So what you're gonna so what you're gonna need for today's activity is a cleaning workspace. I am using my driveway here. I went to the local Dollar General and I found these uh, set of chalks for $10. They had cheaper ones, but um, they had a lot in here and I thought that was a good buy for 10 bucks. So I went ahead and got the big one. And then at home, I just happened to have this painter's tape because I was painting my baby's room a couple months back. If you have tape like this, that's great. If not, you can use the masking tape um, that uh, is like a kind of a yellowy beige color that would work too. Anything that would quick release off of the sidewalk is gonna be awesome. So what I'm gonna do is I'm going to take the tape in just a second and I am going to lay out a design. So the first thing I did was I just took my blue tape and I made out a little frame. For my work, you can make this as big or as small as you would like. You could do a bunch of these, or you could um, work on a really big one with your brothers and sisters. So I'm gonna start putting down my design in the middle, and I'll show you that in just a second. So now me and my helpers are gonna color this big guy and we'll show you what it looks like when it's all finished, okay? Yep, say hi, Ollie. Oh no, help. We're having a really good time. We're making some progress on our mural and Ollie figured out another activity that maybe your little brothers and sisters can do. He's going around with these tiny chalks and matching them to the colors on the mural. So that's pretty cool too. Good job, Ollie. High five. Yeah. Porter noticed some cool things that maybe you could think about after you're done. What did you notice, Porter? There are several right triangles. Uh-huh. What else? There are several... There's one non-right triangle. Mm-hmm. There are several uh, squares and rectangles. Uh-huh. So you could There's... count how many shapes you made, what different types of shapes you ended up making. Yeah, and some of these are irregular pentagons and trap and, uh, and trapezoids. Cool. So you could group things by the type of color you made. Is it warm or cool colors? What kind of shapes? How many of each did you make? And now we're going to take off the tape. So Porter, do you want to reach down and start pulling the tape off for me? Yeah. All right. Let's see how this really looks now that we're done. Wow, that was a pretty good pull. Keep going, keep going. Ollie, will you help him? Get some tape, Ollie. Yeah. I hope that you and your family have as much fun as me and my kids did making our chalk mural. I think it came out pretty cool, pretty awesome. And remember, you can think about matching colors with your little brothers and sisters. You can look for shape. Oh. Don't forget to be patient with your little brothers and sisters. They're at home too.